Yar, vasty mateys. Tis be pixel piracy on the port bow. Shiver me timbers and swab my poop decks. Yar. <laughs> Um, yeah, Pixel Piracy. Uh, uh, this is a, another Steam early access game. At least I think it is. Um, I tend to wait way too long on these games and um, wonder sometimes if they're already like full and done by the time I decide to post these. But uh, at any rate, it was early access. Really crazy game. Um, this is a little bit different from my other demo doomsdays because this one I've actually played a little bit already, just to get a little flavor, just to get a little feel of it. Uh, whether or not that's evident from the get go here, uh, you'll have to be the judge of. But right now we have Captain Happy here. This is Captain Happy. This is my health, my hunger, and my morale. Very important things to keep track of. Uh, I also have my crew if they get over here. There we go. No, nope. okay, get over here. There's one of them, Hork. He's uh, not listening. Hork, get over here. Right click to command your crew, left click to command your captain. And uh, yeah, here's Hork. <laughs> I started off with him because uh, you get options when you start off this game, you know, just to kind of set the, the pace of the game from the get go. Not a permadeath game, though. Um, not really, because it saves after every place you travel to. But it sets itself up like that because you customize everything. The name of my pirate, um, the difficulty, I have it on easy. It's called princess mode. This is princess mode. Okay, don't laugh at me. <laughs> Stop it. Um, and uh, also you can choose your personality. You can start off with TP, bonus TP, whatever the hell that is. Um, an extra pirate, which is what I went for, or a special weapon. So Hork was the special pirate I started off with. I did get to choose him. This is just who I got. Uh, I also have another guy, but he's not listening to me, probably because he's not happy. Here, this will be easier to show. So this is Captain Happy. <laughs> uh, he is snooty. This pirate is very stuck up. Well, very much like me. <laughs> he is a chubby man. He has at least four love handles, also like me. He was a berserker, a Norseman of old. This pirate tumbled down a hull in Greenland only to have the Northern Lights scoop him up and plop him into a pirate sim. Alright. <laughs> okay, then. Um, uh, he has stats. I assume they're good. They're yellowish. I think that's a good thing. He also has a black cape, which is a passive equip, a 20% dodge chance. I have a cutlass on him. Don't have a ranged weapon on him yet, though. So yeah, he's fat, so he's 3% slower. These are kind of his talents, if you will. They call them perks, but uh, I don't know what the perk is to being fat. I still haven't figured that out yet in real life. Uh, cleaning, parry basics, this is all stuff I'm teaching him. Uh, XP level, TP, which I think is connected to intelligence. I think it has to do with skills, like how well you learn is another thing I'll get to. Then there's Hork. Uh, Hork is just kind of my everyman here. He's snarky, a cynical pirate. He'll often stir up fights between friends. Hmm, interesting. He is scarred. Many scars line this man's body, front and back. Uh, he has seen battle. He was a druid. He would make magic potions for many ungrateful townsmen who squandered its miraculous use on beating armor clad men into dirt for no reason. <laughs> All right, then became a pirate. My pirate, first mate, Hork. <laughs> so yeah, I start off with him, and then we have Felix Castiglio. I bought him. Uh, there's taverns. Well, right now, of the crazy massive pirates you have over here. This is a tavern. If I go over here and press space, I can actually buy pirates, which is what all this crazy empty space is for. Uh, so we got Felix here. Uh, he is happy. Nothing gets this pirate down. Sunshine and splendid days for him on the high seas. Uh, he is a stocky man of short stature, but of average build. He was an assassin. This pirate used to take contracts out in his maiden country until he killed the wrong man. Scandal. Um, yeah, I mainly got him because it said he was a, assass a ninja, I think. When you go and buy these people, it gives you little, uh, you know little quirks about them, like what they used to be. Um, see, this guy's a popper, peeger, merchant, smuggler, anchor smith, mage, fishmonger, a bunch of fishmongers and peegers. I don't know what that 
guys. Uh, Ninja. Um, up and coming boxer, JC Nissenson. Um, yeah, I think this one said he was a ninja, so I was like, hell yeah, I gotta have a ninja on my pirate crew. Obviously. Uh, um, and uh, so yeah, I picked him up. Um, but he came with the perk of being abstinent. He doesn't drink. Uh, this is actually a problem, because right now you can see he's kind of meh, you know, kind of content right now. Not really too happy like Hork or uh, Happy is, ironically. Not ironically. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Um, usually when you take guys to a tavern, their morale goes up. But as you can see, his morale is kind of low. So he's getting less and less happy, uh, despite him being, uh, you know, having nothing get him down. So, I guess all I could do is pay his really expensive salary. Um, this is my gold right here. So, there. Now he's happy. <laughs> uh, that was the trick I found really early on in this game, is I would pay their salary to make them happy, then I realized, oh, take them to a tavern. They're happy already. And then this is a weapon shop. Uh, that's a chicken. Food. Which I might actually need more food here pretty soon. Because I'm getting really hungry. Yeah, I'll go buy some food. This is also a bookshop. This is where you buy talents. Um, you give them to crew members. See, cleaning <clears throat> was something I gave Hork um, to learn. And I think that's where TP comes into play. Still not sure how exactly that works. Uh, map reading, parry, basics, and cleaning also uh, gave to the captain. Map reading is actually... Um, seems like a really good uh, talent to have for the very beginning of the game. So, pro tip. Pirate pro tip. Yar. <laughs> Stick that in your chest and plunder it. Um, where am I going? I don't want to go here. <laughs> I want to buy food. Plus, I'm fat, so it's going to take me a while to get over here. Alright. So fat, I can't even get to the food fast enough. Um, there's ramen bowls. Really expensive. But they're five servings. Go buy a couple of those. Yeah, I need food because hey, let's uh let's show you my ship here. Ta-da! Isn't it beautiful? Look how awesome it looks. Oh, it's gorgeous. I call her I call her uh Yes uh Evangeline. I call her the Evangeline. Yeah, so left click, right click, get my captain and my crew over there, if they listen to me this time. Yeah, okay, they're listening to me. Also, picking up a lot of other guys. What are you guys doing? Get out of here. Get, get out of here. Get out of here, Herb. Herb Gandhi. Interesting. Interesting combination of names. And they're pooping on my ship. Yeah, cleaning is also another extremely important uh, perk to have. Yeah, get the hell off of the Evangeline. You shit. Um, because it gets rid of poop. I don't know what the point of that is. Uh, maybe food doesn't spoil as much. I don't even know if food does spoil. But I got some ramen. Put it on my ship. Yeah, and there's a ship set up. I got basic stuff. I just started this game, so whatever. <laughs> so uh, let's go explore the world, shall we? Um, yeah, so here we got islands... Random encounters, which are always bad, uh, just so you know. Pro tip, yar, pirate pro tip. Uh, pirates, you know, he fights ships. Um, neutral, I don't know. Islands always kick my butt. Then <laughs> he got this guy over here. Legendary enemy, danger, either 10,000 or 10. I still can't figure it out if that's a period or a comma. But... He's badass, I'm pretty sure is what the game's telling me. And there's another one over here, just to add to it. And another one over there. Look, look at all these. Is there any more? Any more? Okay. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, you know what I'm going to try to do? Maybe Danger 2. Yeah, they don't tell me the danger of the islands, but most of them kick my ass anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Eh. Let's go to Brock, an island named Brock. No, or maybe, hmm. But this is why map reading is important, because before I had map reading, none of this was uh, available to me. It was only, you know, the immediate 
areas around where I was. Um, so it seems like a really uh, good thing to have Davis Crossroads. Not sure how an island can be Crossroads. Oh, I'm having a really hard time deciding. Let's see, we got Rome. Oh yeah, Rome population three. Yeah, it's got two shops, is that it? Yeah. <laughs> I found Rome. Alberton. Uh, none of these have taverns. Which again, taverns are important for your cruise morale without having to spend money. But again, Felix is just going to be a jerk the whole time. Eh, well, yeah, let's go to Brock. So yeah, you just pick a destination, go there, do things, plunder, pillage, rape, uh, maybe not so much the rape. Kind of forgot pirates did that. Did they? Probably. They probably did. Alright. So what does this island have in store for me? Fortunately, I could scroll across the whole island. And we got monkeys that have bananas. I don't know what the hell that is. And a statue, tribal statue. I think I could handle this. I think I could do this. Let's go, guys. Let's kick these monkeys' asses. Yeah, let's go. Get Felix. Come on, Felix. I don't like how little Felix responds to me. Kill and murder. That's a big monkey. <laughs> and his name is Vance. Okay, whoever has the cutest name gets to live. Uh, none of you have cute names. You actually have a bunch of jock names. <laughs> Rayford. Actually, I don't know what that is. Vaughn. Troy. Yeah, you're all dead. <laughs> Spared nobody. We also have a kitty. Kitty Woodrow. Okay, the cat stays. The cat can survive. He can survive to tell everybody else what happened here. <laughs> I'm like the, the couple from uh, Natural Born Killers that way. Leave one alive. Hey, guys, help me out here. I can't fight this monkey all by myself. Yes, this is how fighting works. It's kind of a clusterfuck. Um, I can imagine when you get more pirates, it becomes even more so. Or if you're fighting more things. Um, also, if you click on treasure chests, it doesn't do anything, but you have this command bar down here. Uh, you have order crew to a location, which I do right-clicking anyway. Choose your target, who you want to kill, which I do, again, left right-clicking anyway. Interact. Uh, chests or interactables. Um, plunder enemy ship, capture enemy ship, and mount animal. Uh, apparently animals are a thing. I don't know how that works. I got a life buoy, bottle of rum, grindstones. Got a lot of grindstones. Okay, I got this tribal statue, but from my experiences of these things, not gonna end well. Maybe? Sometimes? Oh, okay. Tribal TP blessing. Never mind then. Usually when I click on those things, um, a bunch of tribal men show up and kick my ass. Tribal men are tough. Really, really tough. I don't understand why, but they only inhabit islands, obviously. They're not on ships or anything. But for some reason, I can handle pirate ships, no problem. Islands, it's, you know, 50-50. I got lucky with this island. I dub the Monkey Island. Well, not <laughs> it's not Monkey Island no more. <laughs> uh, I'm an evil person. All right, Lone Tree. Weird. Uh, Bridgeville, <laughs> Meldron. These are fun names. Villanau, Cedar Hill, Ashford, Dominic, Brooksville, and Cookstown. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna stay away from this event because usually it's like oh so and so sick of sailing so pay them 500 gold and I'm like fuck you and then they fight me and then I die and then nobody's happy but yeah you notice uh, between anywhere you're about to travel it asks you if you want to save so it's it's not one of those you know again permadeath survivor type of games like if I die here I can just reset <clears throat> and it's roguelike so um, Sometimes I'll go to an island, it'll kick my ass, I'll die, but then when I reload, go back to the island, it's different. So, you never know. Uh, speaking of dying, uh, is that Felix? Felix, dude, you're my ninja, come on. My ninja. Alright, there we go. Yeah, see, pirates are usually no problem. And then, 
best part about fighting pirate ships. I go plunder. BAM! And I get gold, and uh, it doesn't seem like I get all their uh, ship parts. If you capture enemy ship, um, I've done this before, and I just got their ship. Like, I lost all of my other stuff I had on the ship I was currently sailing, and it was just sailing their ship. So, capture doesn't, you know, I thought I'd just, you know, take all their crap and would be able to use it for my own purposes, but don't think that's the case. The hell? Republic? Don't know what that is. Uh, crap, we're already at Danger 2 territory. What the hell? I even venture off that far. <laughs> okay, let's go to Cedar Hill and take on this level 1 pirate. Save game. Gotta find another island with a, a, a tavern. Oh! Hork, come on. Where's your sense of decency? Man. Pooping on my ship. Oh, okay, I'm looking out with these islands. I swear, they're not always this easy. One pirate. I never have this problem. And the crabs are like the monkeys, they're neutral. Which I think is what that bird symbol means. Frowny face, obviously. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna take this well. And there's oysters! I love oysters! Because sometimes they'll drop pearls. And pearls sell for a lot of money. Mm -hmm. They sell for um, one of Felix's pay stubs and then some. Just to give you an idea. Oh, Hork, what? Are you having a party over there, man? Or Oh, I was worried about this. I think he's bleeding, but I don't think I have anything for that anymore. Oh, dear. <laughs> that ain't good. Oh, I could heal him. Yeah, so these are all items I've been getting from chests. Um, Uncle's teeth. Mostly boost morale, heal a little bit. Um, 2 HP. Oh, and 50 hunger. It's not too bad. Monkey's tail, elixir. Wolf claw gives 200 XP. Grindstones are cool, because um, these are his weapons. Do I have anything better? No, I have a knife. Okay, these are his weapons and grindstones, uh, melee, and uh, ranged, if I had any ranged weapons. <laughs> Still haven't found any of those yet. Um, they upgrade them, and I think what happens is the stars at the bottom go up and the stats of the weapon go up so it's a good thing to have and I've been collecting a lot so anyway Hork is dying uh, focus let me give you an elixir I hope bleeding out stops at one point I'm not gonna bother the tribal statue this time cuz uh, yeah yeah see a lot of grindstones just from that chest a white flag diapers oh yeah I know what diapers do they stop your crew from pooping, which I just sell them because if your crew can clean, then I mean, poop gets uh, taken care of pretty uh, frequently. How are you doing, Hork? Still not too good. Hork, you gotta stop bleeding, man. I'm worried. <laughs> I'm gonna lose Hork. This is embarrassing. The minute I start recording this and one of my crew members dies of blood loss, tis a pirate's life. Yar. Unfortunately, boxes and I'm pretty sure oysters don't fight back, so... <gasps> oh, I got a bandage! I think. Yeah, here we go. Combat focus. Combat focus. Teaches combat focus. <laughs> Plus crit chance. So is it... Plus 20 agility on Kasum. Oh, like the entire... Oh, that's pretty sweet. Oh, you know what I'm going to give that to? Fucking happy, man. That's all the agility you can get. Also, combat focus. Combat. I don't know if I could spread them too thin with talents. But I also don't know who my fighter is. That's not Hork. <laughs> Strength is at four. But also, Felix's sucks too. I'm gonna save it. Yeah. There. Really odd sound effect, but there we go. <laughs> now let's kill the oysters. Yeah, yeah, they don't stand a chance. Look at them, just sitting there. And I think they have eyeballs, which is really weird. Uh, 
Alright. I guess sure talk a lot, especially when killing oysters. I would have your teeth. Oyster teeth. Felix isn't very smart. <laughs> oh, come on. If I don't get a single goddamn pearl from killing these oysters, where are you going, Felix? Oh, my God. I almost walked right off the beach there. <laughs> I don't think my captain's fighting. Dodge. Dead men tell no tales. So says Hork. <gasps> pearl! Yeah! Only one, but it's, it's okay. I possibly got some experience for that yeah <laughs> Felix got kill XP for uh, destroying that box so I think we're good I'm gonna fight these crabs Jules and Felix <gasps> Felix just like my crew member I don't know why Hork doesn't have a last name it's weird kind of looks like a hobo too <laughs> I don't know about Felix I mean, Hork. <laughs> Get my crew mixed up. Yar, I'm not a good captain. Alright, well that did absolutely nothing. Let's go back to my ship. The Evangeline being protected by seagulls. At ease, gentlemen. Oh, Don't at ease your buttholes, come on. Guys, this is not a poop fest. You seriously, wait until you get on board. My ship. My ship to start pooping everywhere. You couldn't poop on the island? Seriously, man. Oh, oh look at this. Fallon Station, Landa. God, island's name is Landa. <laughs> All right, let's go to uh, another Pirate One, because I know I can do these. I mean, it's not like I'm gonna die all of a sudden. I like to jinx myself. Oh, Felix thinks he likes me. Oh. What else do you have to say? Ooh, my map reading improved. Yeah, yeah, interact. It gives you the option to flee, but I mean, why? <laughs> I chose to be here. Jam! Only one pirate and a treasure chest. It's almost too easy. Bam! There we go. Get up all the coins. All the coins up in her. Get some booty. Yar, I'm just a lonely pirate looking for booty. Uh, okay. This guy, what the hell's that? It's like a pile of cloth. Fruits? Is that what it was? Anyway, I got a lot of gold, holy crap. Um, uh, well, shucks. I still don't know if I should go to him. It's already ranking up to three, or to him. Hmm. Well, it seems like he'd be closer now. But I kind of want to... Eh. Eh. I want to see what this is all about. Let's go to neutral. Let's see what, let's see what this neutral thing is. <clears throat> also, while saving, which is saving, <laughs> sailing, which is the load screen, uh, you slowly level up, which is really nice. Um, but I assume your resources go down a lot quicker, too. Well, escaping, I have a 100% chance. Oh, dear. Um, I'm in over my head, possibly? Let's see. <laughs> let's, let's test this, shall we? I mean, if all else fails, I'll just run away, right? Or heal? I don't know what I'll do. But Felix is getting his butt kicked. Come on, dude. What kind of ninja are you? My god. Oh, uh, one less damage. Ah, I'll give you that. Pearl. Oh, I don't know. Chef's knife. Cook better food. Um. Ah, shucks. Uh. Um. <laughs> take all my food. Because I don't have an elixir. Might have to tell him to leave. Oh, another trick I found. That was one of them, right? Not one of mine. Guys, why aren't they dying? Oh, dear. Okay. Yeah, one thing I learned, if you pause, 
you could actually do the move and attack commands from here, but it's kind of derpy because I can't really see it well. I can't tell who I'm grabbing. Um, really useful. That's how I've gone through most islands is by utilizing that. You know, getting guys who are about to die like the hell out of there. And uh, there. Did that. A little ghost flying away. Nice touch, nice touch. Nobody's bleeding out, right? Oh. <laughs> Scared me. Alright, Felix, come back and help with these boxes. Get over here, Yar. Alright, well, uh... Neutral. Neutral ships. That was a hoot. <laughs> I guess I could take on Danger 2 two now. At least I think that's what it's telling me. Was that cake? I got cake and sour cabbage. Cake and sour cabbage. I feel like there's a lot more to this than that. Uh, guys, do what I tell you. <laughs> Come on. Alright, well, uh... Cool. Fish, meat, 100 gold. Kicking the poop off my ship. Always a good time. My god, where's all the, all the towns? I want to stop at a town. <laughs> uh... Davis Crossroads... Another neutral, Wilmer, Wilmer, Daryl, they're just naming them after people, <laughs> Landa, oh yeah, uh, Wilmer, <laughs> I guess, let's see what Wilmer's all about, finished off with my ramen balls, I see. Wilmer is one pirate, two pirate, three pirate, four pirate. And a whole bunch of crabs. Um, huh. Where? I feel like I should have better weapons by this point. I mean, that's a good weapon. That's not a good weapon. Oh, here we go. Cutlass. You take that. I don't have any ranged weapons still. You think we could do this? Let's try. Let's end this on a low note. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> God damn it. Kill and death and kill and poop. Or poop later. Kill now. Kill now, poop later. Let's all focus on one guy. Yeah, this guy's not going to get here in time, is he? Oh, God. Just know there are sharks in the water. <laughs> Big sharks. Oh, Captain. God, you guys are not good at fighting. <laughs> uh, two TP. How's Cake not heal me? Eh. And eh. And fighting some more. I don't know. I think Captain's got to make a run for it. Oh, God. Is that one of mine or is that one of theirs? Ah, run! Ah! <laughs> Go. Ah, run. Run. Run, Hork. Oh, God. Well, I managed to kill one of them, but I also... ah, uh... What? <laughs> <laughs> Gotta love my crew. Uh, loyal to the bitter end. Um, so that's Pixel Piracy. <laughs> Go check it out for yourself. Um... I'm going to probably do another episode of this. It's, I'm not done, damn it. I must have my vengeance. Revengeance. Whatever the hell. Yar.